with a call for action to help track monarch butterflies. Their numbers are at an all-time low, but today a challenge was launched to help them bounce back. Action News reporter Phil Gomez is live in Santa Cruz with our top story tonight. Phil? Yeah, and here on the Central Coast, people are being asked to report sightings of monarch butterflies. The data collected will give much-needed insight into the butterflies. And if you see a monarch outside, take a picture, and there is an incentive for you to do so. If you see a monarch butterfly outside, all you have to do is take a picture. The data collected will give researchers much needed insight into the butterfly's habitat needs during the spring months so researchers can target conservation efforts. We want to learn what plant communities they're utilizing, uh, where they're stopping, where they're nectaring, are they roosting, uh, what, what are they up to in between this period of time. Monarch butterflies spend the winter in groves of trees like here at the Natural Bridges State Park Monarch Butterfly Preserve. They recently held a migration festival, but there are plenty of empty tree branches where the monarchs are usually spotted. This year we saw them leave Natural Bridges itself in December with the first winter storms that came in. And they're still hanging out at Lighthouse Field State Beach, although not as many. And that's why schools and other visitors come here, so they can look up into the trees for the monarchs. It definitely looks uh, a lot less lush than when I've been here when there are lots of butterflies. Solving the mystery of where the wild migratory western monarch are at this time of year is a way to help restore the monarch population. Have you seen any monarchs? Butterflies? Mm. I think I might have um, at a museum. So remember, a quick snapshot could preserve the monarch for generations to come. The Western Monarch Mystery Challenge will award weekly prizes to participants who share photos of or videos of monarch butterflies away from their wintering habitats. Erin? All right, Phil, thank you. Uh, so once you snap your photo or take your video, here's where you can send it. You can get the free app, iNaturalist, or you can email it to monarchmystery at wsu.edu. Make sure to include the date, species, and location with all the pictures and videos. And if you do any of this, you will automatically be entered to win a weekly prize.